is the life. This is the broken life of a guy who can't afford anything. Because you see, look at this place. Look how ugly this place is. It's the only place I can afford. But the sad thing is that I have a roommate who seems to never be here, Tom. He's never here. And yet, I can't even afford this shitty place myself. But this is my life. I'm Derek Walters. And you see, my, lo my love of life is cars. I've loved cars ever since I was a little kid. And look at this car that I have here. Someone who dreamt of one day owning a Bugatti is driving this piece of crap. Now, as you can see, I'm on my way to work where I have any. Anyway, so I guess this is a little time to tell you about myself. I was a. My dad left me when I was two years old, and my mom passed away a couple years back. I've been alone here in Los Santos. It's been really, really crazy. Currently up here at Toledo Bay, the 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 butt Idaho of Los Santos. And and this is just my life. This is the life life of a normal poor mechanic who because honestly, I don't have any other passion but for cars. As you see, this is the place I work. Not exactly the best place. This is where all the scum scumbags hang out. But it, it, it's the only job I can. My history is the fact that due to the fact that I love cars so much that I had trouble when I was younger. As soon as I got my license, I got into trouble with racing racing stealing cars I was a I was a below end I was a disappointment to my family and then and then it just so happened that once I tried to apply for school after I got out of the life try to become a f real mechanic it, they didn't accept me because of my criminal past so now I'm stuck here. I'm stuck here in a low level garage. Because this is the only job I can find with a dickhead of a boss. And that's just what I have to go through now. I have to work on these crappers all day. So, oh man. Man, these cars are looking pretty good. Man, I'm actually proud of myself right now. Like, oh crap. I just realized something. I forgot to put the tuner back in. Alright. Hey, dickhead. H h hello, sir. Hey. Are you done with Mr. Applebee's car yet? Which one's Mr. Applebee's again? Oh, you mean this one. This um, one. Yeah, yeah, it's all done, sir. Alright. Took you long enough. Well, well, sir, I'm the only one that's working on the car, so... I I said! I said we'd get you a new employee soon, didn't I? Y you said that three years ago. You've been saying that for three oh, years. Oh. It's a tough business, I'm still looking. Oh, man! It smells like cat piss in here! Probably because... Probably because things from the gutter clean this car out clean it out now I don't want it in my area clean it out yes sir disgusting I'll be back yes sir man that guy's such a fucking asshole I wish I, I, I honestly wish I can quit this job, honestly, but I can't, because it's literally the only source of income I have. Turn on the, turn on the radio.
there. This is what my life has become to. Man, I had all the potential in the world. All right, I'm taking the car now. Okay, sir. That guy's such a piece of crap, man. Honestly, I'm so done with this guy. Uh. All right. My car has been having some engine troubles. You're not getting paid for this car, but I need you to do it. So I'm getting it done for free. So I need my engine done, and I need it done well. And if it's not done well, then guess what? You're not getting any kind of pay. You just said you weren't paying me regardless for this car. You won't get your weekly. You won't get your weekly pay. This car is my baby. It's a classic. It's a 1980 classic, baby. You can't get a car like this anymore. One of the best cars you could ever find. Look at the beauty. Look at the design. Look at the modifications done to it. Uh, modifications that you could never do. There's a low-level piece of shit mechanic. I mean, I probably could and... if I had a team if I wasn't by myself, but... You know what? I'm oh, sorry, yes. Sir. Anyways, turn some music on in here. So quiet. I'll put on some smooth jazz. There you go. This car is such a piece of shit. How's Mr. Dylan's car doing? Mr. Dylan's car is pretty much done, sir. Pretty much done? Yes, sir. Yeah, it's good enough. I'm gonna go take it to his house. There's gonna be two. There's gonna be another car coming in later, so you better get ready, and you better have my car done by tomorrow. Tomorrow? Jesus, that guy. Jesus, guy's an asshole. All right, well, I guess such. A... God, this guy pisses me off. Whatever, I'll fix his car. Whatever. Boop, boop, boop. Alright, let's see. What's the problem here? Jesus Christ, does this guy not know how to work a car? Goodness, his engine shot to shit. Man, man, I wish I... And I'm just so tempted just to... Just to break everything in this guy's car. But then I wouldn't have a job. Guys, such... yes, sir. Hello. I have another car coming. Do you remember Mr. Ortwin? Mr. Ortwin, uh, yeah, yeah. Why? Yeah, well, he's bringing his car in again for the fifth time this week because apparently, apparently, someone keeps fucking up. I get. It's not me, sir. I don't know what he's doing to his car. Well, his car's literally a, being... like like his car's a piece of crap. Like there's like nothing I can do. Listen, I don't know what it is, and I don't really care. Okay, he's a hard-paying customer who pays every time his dumbass comes in here. You're going to take care of his car, no questions asked, and you're going to take care of my car as well, no questions asked. Okay, sir. Hello? Hello? Do you understand? Yes, sir. Good, you better. I'll be bringing the car in. You better be there and ready to take the car. Yes, sir. Remember, it... customers are priority even over me for whatever reason, so... Well, you take sir, care of your, your car's pretty much done. Already? Yes, sir. And what world does cars take that quick to be done? Uh, there's nothing seemed to be wrong with your car, sir. There was just there was what just do you a, mean? there was just a little uh, piece of god that was stuck to your engine. All right. Well, this guy's engine's smoking for God's sakes. And that's m never mind. All right, sir. Bring it in whenever you can. Give me something to do. I'll be bringing it in a few minutes. 
Okay, sir. Thank you. All right, let's see what the issue is here. Uh, uh, look at this goddamn oh. car. It's freaking smoking, and I, the, the guy's coffee spilled over my goddamn suit. Is my car done yet or not? Yes, your car is done. Goodness, sir. Take well, I gotta car. go buy a new. I gotta buy go buy a goddamn new suit because of you. Because of me. Next what? time I'm. Next time I'm sending you to pick up the fucking cars. I'm done helping you. I do all the work around here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Sir. Sure. We'll go with that. Also, I have some business coming by. Um, some people that own this garage, so I'm gonna have to talk to them. Now, hurry up and get your shit together. Right, let's see what's wrong with this guy's car this time. This guy just wanted to say fuck you. <sighs> yes. Hello. Don't. Uh. So you're gonna. Uh, you're also staying late tonight as well. Am I getting paid overtime? No, of course not. You... But we have another car coming in already. Busy day today. Well, yes, sir. But and like I, I said, I know, I I know you're not gonna get either car done today, obviously, because you can't finish a car in two minutes. But uh, you're gonna have to at least check this one out and give the guy confirmation. I've got to give him a rental car. Yes, no, I know. The, but, sir, there's m nothing I can do with Mr. Orwin's car. Well, you're gonna have to fix it somehow. I don't know. <sighs> Keep it in the shop for a few days. See what you can do with it. I'm bringing by a, uh, I'm bringing by uh, Miss, Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Tragic's car. Well, truck. Okay, sir. I'll take a look at it. All right. All right. Yeah, this car is like a piece of crap. I don't know how. I don't know how he keeps on taking Mr. Orwin's money. It's honestly nothing I can do with the car. I've tried to fix it four times. Keeps on getting the coffee. He keeps on getting the stick shift sticky due to his coffee. Oh, uh, hello, hello, sir. All right. Here's Miss Tragic's truck. All right. Okay. All right. I'm All right. going home to go to bed now. Well, to jerk off, then go to bed. So. See you later. Okay, sir. All right, let's see. Um... Oh, Jesus! It's almost Jesus. Seven o'clock. Jeez, I'm at, like an hour past overtime. Good. I gotta. I, I'm. I'm going home. Screw this. I can deal with this tomorrow. <sighs> Hello. Hey. I'm gonna need you to come in early tomorrow as well. What time? Well, I usually start at 8, but I'm gonna need you to come in at 6. I need you to get these cars done. Yes, sir, because I can't, I can't do anything right now. Thank you. Yep, whatever, bye. Alright, so... Oh, man, what a long day, man. And I really hate this job. So hard, so hard to do. Honestly, I'm so sick and tired of the way he treats me. Like there's some times where I wish I could just end it and just, just punch him in the face. So honestly, he doesn't pay me enough for the way he abuses me. I'm just so done. Whatever, I, I need a paycheck. So come tomorrow, things will be a better day. Hopefully. Oh. <laughs> 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 Second man. <laughs> wow, that's some good shit. Oh, what, what time is it? Uh, six thirty in the morning. Six thirty. 
Yeah. Oh shit! I overslept. No, what's wrong, buddy? Come on, I'm never home. We we should uh, we should hang out. Go grab a bite to eat or something. Dude, I I can't. I gotta work. Come on, dude. I have the fucking munchies. Let's just go out somewhere to eat, bro. We'll take my van. No, Fuck your I... boss, bro. Fuck I... your boss, bro. Fuck your boss. Your boss is a piece of shit. He treats you like a piece of ass, bro. Yeah, you know he may treat me like a piece of shit, but look, I gotta fucking go to work. Cause how do you expect me to pay for this place? Man, I, I pay my half of the rent. I'm gonna go have a shower then. Fuck, buddy. Okay, I'm going to work. Guys, just always high, man. Oh, man, I don't want to go into work so early. Like, I'm already running late. Like, so frustrating. Stupid alarm clocks don't work. It's been, it's been a weird... It's just a regular morning. Oh, God damn it! Stupid light! I gotta get across the street. I'm literally like a block away. Can't let. Let me just. Yeah. Oh. Oh. What is that? Car. What, what's that car doing here? That. Why is that car in my spot? She's some dingus, like, seriously parked in my spot. God damn it. Oh, I guess I have to park out here then. That's fine. Alright. Time. Alright. Let's see. Let's, let's go. Uh, hello, hello, sir. Are you, uh, is this is these one of your two cars here? Where's Larry? Uh, I don't, I don't know where he is, sir. Listen up, fucking chooch. I said, where the fuck is Larry? I, I, I don't know. I don't know where he is. Listen up. I'm not fucking joking. Where the fuck does he live? I don't know where he lives. No, I'm not joking now. Neither, neither am I, sir. I'm being dead serious. I don't know who he is. Who are you? Larry. Larry owns the Capa the Picardo family some money for protection. And Larry hasn't paid up this month. I mean, that doesn't explain him. He is a cheapskate. So either you pay me the $500 or I burn this shop to the ground. I I, I don't have $500 here, sir. If you want, I'll, well, I'll call him for you. I'll give you his number. Well, how are these cars? How good are these cars in condition, wise? Um, well, this van here is pretty much like done for. There's not much I can do. He just keeps on bringing them in because it's worthless. This truck, I don't know. I was going to start this morning, but. Well, I'm gonna go on this computer over here. You look at this truck and see how it is. Okay, sir. You have ten minutes. Ten minutes? Okay. Alright, let's see. Let's take a look in here. Uh, man, why... This guy... This whole... This guy's whole transmission looks like shot. Only in Polito Bay. We'll see what else is down here. Uh... Jesus, like, it looks like someone, like, put, like, like, is that, like, uh, some, looks like someone swung a baseball bat to this engine. Ooh, ooh. That, that's weird. Alright, listen, I don't have all day to play around. My boss just called me. I don't have all day to play around now. Uh, yes, sir. Listen, if Larry comes by... You tell him the Picardo family has called and Vincenzo wants his money. Okay. Okay, sir. That's all you have to say. You could shut up about everything else. Okay, sir. I'm taking this truck. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't do that. I mean, the transmission's like shot, but. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, I got better mechanics. Don't worry. You know what? What's your name? 
Derek. Derek what? Walters. Do you even like working here? In this shop? This piece of shit. I, I see. Look. I see a cockroach over there. Oh, yeah. Um, honestly, I don't like working here. Uh, personally, personally, it's because it's the only job I can get. I really don't like, I really don't like, I really don't like working here, no, I, I don't, but honestly, it's the only place that will really take me. Okay, let me ask you another question with that question. How do you like working for that piece of shit, Larry? Uh, not very much at all. Uh, listen, here's my card. If you want somewhere better to work, you call that number. I mean it. Oh, oh okay. Uh, th th thank you, sir. Oh, man. Tell Larry. Tell Larry, by the way. Vincenzo thinks he's a fucking prick. Thanks. Yes, I, I will do that, sir. Uh, thank you. Hmm. Now this door doesn't even open. Jesus. Man, this, this guy, uh, that guy seemed like a nice guy. Hmm. All right. So, all right. Let's try to fix Mr. Orton's car. Nothing much I can do. Maybe I'll just throw on. Maybe I'll just throw on a tie and bow. I don't know. Uh, um, hello. It's Larry. Oh, uh, hey, hey, boss. What's up? Leave the shop. Leave, leave the shop. Okay. Yeah, I'm outside. Come in my car. All right, sir. No problem. Bloop. Okay, let's see what he has to talk to me about. Oh, uh, nice uh, Hawaiian shirt, sir. You bet you're not used to being in a nice car like this, huh? Anyways, I saw on the shop cameras. Was there a guy here in a, uh, that came up in a, four, in a big SUV? Uh, oh, yes, sir. Uh, uh, I believe his name was... Vincenzo. Vincenzo. Yeah. Vincenzo. You don't even gotta say it. Yeah, you don't even gotta say it. I already know who it is. Yeah, he told me that you owed him money. Owed him like yeah. 500 bucks. I do. I do. So listen, I'm gonna need 500 bucks from you. 500 bucks? Sir, I don't even have 500 bucks in my name right now. Well, you're gonna have to find a way or else I'm not gonna be able to pay you for a while. So. Are you... Sir, I have like 750 bucks to my name. Well, can you lend me the 500? I'll pay it back to you whenever I can. Are you sh sure you would? I'm, I'm sure you would. Yeah. Fine. Alright, let me drop by your house. Oh, you got it? Okay. Thanks. Uh, I'm still gonna have to stop paying you for a while. Are you? Sorry, it's just I'm it, money's really tough right now, you know. So you're gonna have to work for like a month unpaid. A month? Yeah, just about. It'll be all right. I'll like uh, I'll buy you like a like a, a taco a day or something. It'll be all right. Just just borrow some food off that stupid roommate of yours. You probably won't remember. Stoned half the time. That. <sighs> yes, sir. All right. Well. Where are you taking me? Oh, just going for a drive. Mostly because I think that mafia guy's been following me all day today. I haven't paid him as five hundred bucks. All right. Anyways, get out here. Uh, I'm too late to drive you back to the shop. You can walk. Thanks. Man, what a fucking morning.
You're literally not getting paid for a fucking month. The water, my fucking thing got shut down. Fucking Tom ate all of her fucking food. <sighs> so tired of this bullshit. Light fucking turn. I want to get the fucking my workless job, fucking payless job. So frustrated. I can't even say my words straight. It's ridiculous. Why you fuck you crossing you stupid idiot? What a dumbass not a body go law. Fuck, I'm so tired of this. Alright, time to fucking turn in here. Alright, let's see. Why is both these hoods up? Why the, why the fuck's the engine gone in this fucking truck? Oh, no. no. Why the fuck is it gone out of this truck? Oh, my fucking God. Where the fuck did the engines go? He's gotta be fucking- You know what? Fuck this! I'm done! I'm fucking done! Fucking done! So fucking done with this bullshit! Fucking gonna call this fucking- Fucking ass clown. Brr, brr. Uh, uh, yes! This is Larry where the, White speaking! Where the fuck are the engines? In those two cars that are in your goddamn piece of shit garage! Hey, listen, what the heck is your problem? Calm the hell down. No! What do you mean? What no, I'm missing? fucking tired of it! I'm fucking tired of it! You're fucking threatening to fucking pay me for fucking nothing for the month, and then I come here to fucking work, and all the, and okay. the fucking engines Stop are gone! Stop cursing. Stop cursing. Okay, stop cursing. Where are I'll you? I'll be there. I'm at my house. Well, come over here and so solve this fucking problem now. Okay, God. Beep. Oh, I'm so fucking done. I'm gonna like gonna fucking punch a hole in this goddamn wall. Like, just fuck this fucking. Mm. I'm so fucking done with this. I'm, I swear I'm gonna fucking kill this guy. All right, what the hell's the problem? Why are you whining, God? What do you think Rock. the fucking problem is? I told you what the fuck the Jeez. problem was. It's seven in the morning, man. Yeah. You know I don't wake up. To, you know what? You know you're supposed to start at six. I don't come in till one thirty, and then I leave at two. You know how this yeah. works? Yeah. You have any idea how fucking unfair it is? Fucking drive all your. How's that unfair? Out? How's that unfair? How's that unfair? You work from six to six, and, and I not, work from two thirty to three. And you ain't paying me shit. And I'm paying you. I've fucking... always paid you. You've worked here for five years. I've always paid you well. So don't be ungrateful, you stupid bitch. 6.15 an hour? 6.15 an hour? Listen, do not bite the hand that feeds you, you frickin'. You're a loser, man. I, I didn't even have to give you this job. I did not. I did not have to give you this job. You were I... nothing. You don't even have any mechanic training background other than you stole some cars and stuff. Who cares? I should have never hired you. I could have hired someone more qualified. But yeah, I gave you, you a chance. And you yeah, and you could, except no one would work for you because you're nothing but a piece of shit. Excuse me? I will fight you right now. Say that shit again. Say it again. Oh, that you're a piece Say of shit? Say it again. You're a piece of shit. Fuck. Oh, 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 oh. You know what? You know what? Fine. Do that. You're fired. You're fired. I'm calling the cops. I'm so done. You're Come never working out. for a mechanic shop again. Come on here, bit. Oh, oh. You're never working for a mechanic shop again! Come on! Come here! Don't make sure of it! <sighs> ah! Fuck! Oh, I'm gonna fuck. I'm gonna fuck. Oh, I'm so fucking sick and tired of this. I'm like, oh man, I'm gonna f lose my mind. Fucking turn! Fucking turn green, stupid light! It seems like the only one of. This fucking piece of shit, Polito Bay, that that abides the law. All these guys fucking run the lights all the time. What's the fucking point? Jesus, like I'm the only law-abiding citizen. It seems. So t tired of this. Like I just got fired from my fucking job. Even though I'm glad, kind of. You know what? I'm. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm fucking gonna go ape shit. Tom, you fucking uh asshole. What did I do, hey man? Oh, you're gonna try this weed, bro. It's for freaking 
Armando from fucking Mexico down the street, bro. Oh my god, it's so good, my Dude, guy. You the weed and shit is the reason why I'm fucking angry at you. You ate all my fucking food. You know that I have. I didn't eat all your food. Bullshit. I ate all your. Oh. Oh. Ow! 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 Dude! What the hell are you thinking doing, man? You're lucky. You're lucky I'm too high to fucking fight right now, buddy. Ah, oh, fucking knock you out right now. Yeah, I'm sure you would. You know, after the Listen, day you're I've had, you're, you're, you're lucky my van is in the fucking shop, man. Not your shop. You're yeah, not your shop. The shop down the, the other shop, the one you're in, you're in, you're in competition with. Uh, well, actually, I, I wouldn't know. I wouldn't have a shop anymore. So I got fucking fired. Well, well, why the hell would you do that? Because. Why would you fucking get fired, done with buddy? this shit? What? I'm done with everything. What? What is what is the problem, bro? We're just chilling. You're being all fucking angry. You're like Godzilla up in this motherfucker. Because I'm done with the way I live my life. I'm tired of taking Listen, orders from piece of here. shit people. So you know what? I'm here, ta ta take a joint, man. Take a joint. You gotta could you gotta chill. Back the fuck away from me. Oh, Stay out okay. of my get out of my sight. I'm gonna go for a walk, okay? Okay, whatever. Have a smoke. Let's smoke some more weed! Weed! Weed life! Oh, I'm so sick of this. I'm so sick of this. You know, you know what? I think I'm gonna give that Vincenzo guy a call. Maybe, maybe, maybe. He said he can offer me a job. Maybe. Maybe I can get out of this. Let's see. Brr, brr. Hello, this is Vincenzo. How are you doing? Who is uh, this? Hello, Vincenzo. This is, um. This is Derek Walters. Um, I'm here to talk to you about that uh, job offer.